हेलो एंड वेलकम टू ऑल ऑन एस एस पी सी यूट्यूब चैनल अहमदाबाद माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर दिशा दलाल परिक आई एम अ न्यूरो फिजियोथेरापिस्ट एंड लेक्चर एट श्री स्वामीनारायण फिजियोथेरापी कॉलेज सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट न्यूरो फिजियोलॉजी ऑफ मसल टोन बट बिफोर दैट आई वुड लाइक टू रिक्वेस्ट ऑल द व्यूअर्स प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब आर यूट्यूब चैनल सो टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विथ यू ऑल अ वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट इन्फॉर्मेशन ऑन हाउ इज द मसल टोन इज मेनटेन इन आर बॉडी सो मसल टोन कैन बी वेरी सिंपली डिफाइंड एज वी ऑल नो दैट इट इज कॉल्ड एज अ स्टेडी स्टेट ऑफ कॉन्ट्रैक्शन विच इज प्रेजेंट इन आर मसल्स इवन एट रेस्ट ओके सो दैट मीन्स इवन वी आर एट रेस्ट एंड डूइंग नथिंग स्टिल देर विल बी सम टेंशन इन आर मसल्स विच यूजली प्रेजेंट and that static state of tension is called as muscle tone okay so how is this muscle tone maintained and what is the neurophysiology behind it that we are going to learn in this video so let's start understanding the neurophysiology behind the normal muscle tone we all know that uh, mechanism behind muscle stretch reflex okay right so see what we have in this figure we have intrafusal fibers extrafusal fibers then we have one a sensory fibers which is going to the spinal cord and then we have gamma motor neuron okay on the left side and then we have alpha motor neuron okay so like the alpha motor neuron is responsible for producing contraction of the extrafusal fibers like that gamma motor neurons are also responsible for producing contraction of the intrafusal fibers or the muscle spindle okay basics we know that alpha motor neurons responsible for contraction of the extrafusal fibers and gamma motor neurons are responsible for producing contraction of the intrafusal fibers now what we need to understand here is the continuous steady state of discharge going along the gamma motor neurons to the muscle spindle okay steady state discharge from continuous steady state discharge from gamma motor neurons to muscle spindle and as a result of muscle spindle always remains in a steady state of tension okay so what here what happen slightest the relaxation of the spindle next impulses comes and along the gamma motor neurons and spindle again contracts right slightest the relaxation then again next impulses come from the gamma motor neurons and then again spindle contracts okay so that means gamma motor neurons always keeps firing the muscle spindle right and so what will happen this stimulus will be picked up by the muscle spindle of contraction and relaxation so this will again go via 1a fiber and 1a fiber will give the impulses to the alpha motor neuron okay and alpha motor neuron will stimulate the extrafusal fibers so basically extrafusal fibers will also remain in a somewhat steady state of contraction because of this alpha motor firing okay so in summary because of continuous discharge of gamma neurons to the muscle spindle muscle spindle remains sensitive to contraction and stretch and this is picked up by 1a fiber and the information sends to the spinal cord okay and reaches to the alpha motor neuron as a result of alpha motor neurons also continuously keeps discharging the stimulus to the extrafusal fibers okay so it means even in the raised position this activity is going on okay so this is a basic phenomena and in the next video we are going to see that how is this gamma motor excitement is controlled by the higher center right if you have any doubt in this basic uh, video about normal muscle tone you can just mail it to me okay and thank you for your uh, listening stay healthy and keep updated and in my next youtube video we'll discuss about this uh, 
uh, how is this gamma motor excitement is controlled by the higher center thank you